Welcome back to Barkerot. Yeah, but hey, have you ever noticed how like the underside of his arms there are glowing? He's got some, uh, got some like really strong deodorant. Really reflective, like very strong with the aluminum. Gentle enough for a freeze, strong enough for a Saiyan. Gentle enough for a freezer soldier. Yeah. Remember this? There's like two other side quests, but I'm guessing that one is, uh... Yeah, that's Malone. There's gotta be a reason he's still chilling here. Yeah, because like, you haven't got any of his nut. Hey! I got him his goddamn fatty fish. I don't think... I, I, his nut probably doesn't exist. I mean, I could figure out what's up with the nut. You could, if anybody could find a man's nut, Kaiser. It's true. This one looks good. It's not in this high lit area. I have flown through every goddamn tree. I have checked the waters. Unless it's hidden in a goddamn cave. Oh, yeah, it's around there actually. Around there actually? Yeah, a little bit to the south. A little bit to the south. Or not south. Uh, I mean uh, east. A little bit of east where you are. You're going west. My sense of direction is up. I am looking for nut. Go up. Uh huh. I saw something glowing down here. No, those are just those. That's just a Cyberman. Still chasing me. Trash. It's just trashy Cyberman. Go away. Ruined. There. Hold on, another trashy Cyberman. Go away. Yeah, tasty, tasty Cyberman. That must be it. Are you fucking kidding me? I am not joking. Not even worth my time. Motherfuckers. I just want this man's crescent tree nut. God damn it! Go up higher. I feel like I'm like way beyond the uh, the zone that it wanted. Trash. <sighs> Die. It's the easiest way to ha handle trash mobs is just fly in circles. Yeah, I mean, right? Like, is it something I have to physically pick up? Or is it just one of those random things that I'll nab? So I'm guessing you're looking at a guide. I mean, I'm looking at a screenshot of where it is. Is it in that rock? Let's see. I broke the rock. Nothing to grab in there. And God damn it, these Cybermen! Okay, hold on. Here, hand it to me. Okay. I'll get us to this nut. Kaiser will get the nut. Oh, is that it? Is that it right beneath that tree? I have like, nutted like a goddamn that truffle pig. <laughs> Kaiser will find that nut. One way or the other. All right, I got your shitty food, Malone. Hey! It's the crap you wanted. I read that as deplorable, guy. <laughs> 
I mean, he wouldn't be wrong. Whoa, now. You're one frosty guy. What'd you say? I said you're a frosty guy. <laughs> yeah, I know. We've seen it. Listen to that man cook. You're gonna have a tasty meal, Bardock. <laughs> Another culinary masterpiece. Sure. Whoa, now. <laughs> I'm not one of those Epicureans, okay? Chef Malone's cuisine. Are you? I'm gonna break you. Okay, fine. Fatty nut fish. Hey. The Malone, Malone special. special. I like his orange scouter. Goes well with his green. He's a very green person. Yeah. <laughs> Adios. Christmas colored motherfucker. All right. Weirdo. Now Weirdo we can go to Kanasa. Yay. Everything on planet Vegeta has been cleaned up, except for literally all the Cybermen just flying around everywhere. But you know what? That's not our issue. Not our problem. Not our clown. Not our circus. All right. All right. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, base crewman. Prince Vegeta's coming through. <gasps> Ooh, the he, prince. We get to see Babby Vegeta. Itty bitty with your Vegeta. Vegeta. Oh my God, is it gonna have fucking Sabbath or are we gonna have oh, Laura Bailey? Which one is it gonna be? Get the hell out of the way. Whatever. <laughs> uh, okay. Mm. Stand to attention. You must be that brilliant scientist I've heard so much about. Oh, please have Nappa with it. Yes! So, Kid, Kid Vegeta with bangs or without bangs? What the hell are you doing? Uh, all right. Oh, is that? Was, who the fuck was that? What's wrong? Is that fucking, uh, Briner? It, it sounds oh, like Briner. I, uh, accidentally left my scouter on search mode. It picked up a reading from that guy over there. Said his power level was around 10,000. That's so impressive. Yes. That's higher than yours. Neat. My scouter's got to be busted. I'll get it. Goes through a hell there. of a puberty. <laughs> 10,000 still no. Kind of adorable for me. considering the All Might and uh even stronger. Decker the relationship. The universe will tremble before me. <laughs> I think that, that might be Briner. It sounds a lot like right him if it ain't. Them stopping by like that made me real nervous. My heart was pounding. But yeah, that brat. He's just as freakishly intimidating as ever. That's for sure. Oh. So Bardock confirmed power level over 10,000. Yeah, right. So yeah, is stronger than Nappa. I didn't mean to. Uh, um, oh. What are you freaking out about? I meant to say that's our Prince Vegeta for you. Oh. Nothing like my kid. He's great. Dude, don't give a shit. Dude, I hate him. Okay, it's fine. He's a little hey, shithead. You listening to me? I'm serious. That's what I meant. Dude, shut the fuck up. Just some spoiled brat. It looks like I was wrong. All right, here's my wallet, and you can fuck my wife. Just don't kill me. <laughs> Are you me? Huh? Um, please don't tell anyone what I said, okay? Is the bartender in front of us? No, he's got a. Oh, that's sprite. right. That's right. He got a little alfalfa oh, sprite. That was a waste of time. Whatever. That kind of was a waste of time. It really was. Just for a cameo from, uh... Look, we needed to prove that they got off planet before it got blown up. I guess that's true. If you didn't see them leave the planet, then how would they survive? That ought to be interesting. 
Although again, we do get another scene sh like that would have been, probably been in the movie. Hey, mm -hmm. Bardock. Next job's on Kanasa, right? Who the fuck are you? I hear there's gonna be a full moon over there. Perfect timing for Saiyans. Lucky you. During a full moon, we just turn into salamanders too. and get smaller. You leave the rampaging to us fighters. You're late. Yeah, something we usually say to you. <laughs> you bet. I've got your rations packed in there too. All right. Okie dokie. Then. Hey, Bardock. <laughs> hey. Bardock. Go on then. Worst damn timing. What does he want? Hell if I know. Yeah. Doctor stuff. So listen, we just finished performing. Look, Kakarot's not getting a wrong, uh, getting along his with his crib mates, extreme. and <laughs> just causing a whole <laughs> lot of commotion. The hair confirms it. <laughs> what the hell? We don't need DNA <laughs> tests here. here this. Oh wait, you don't want to see him? I ain't got time for that. I've got a real fun job to get to. You think being a parent is a fun a job? Year. I got genocides oh, to create. <laughs> I don't my care about my own son, I've got orphans to make. <laughs> Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Wait, hold up, Bardock. Shouldn't you go see him? If you don't hurry up, I'm leaving you behind. <laughs> what a guy. <laughs> Whatever. Time to go. Yeah, they're they're. I am glad that they're making Bardock an actual asshole. Yeah. No, he does not give a shit about his son. Zzz. Right, I've got two of those. Oh man, I've got two of those. Like, what is Raditz doing right now? For real. He's like. I mean, in Bardock, we see he's literally hanging out with Nap and Vegeta. Yeah. Which is. Or in, Bro know, in Broly, you mean? Oh, I did I say Bardock? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and Broly. Super Broly. Welcome to Freeze the Planet 419. Huh? Oh, shit. Didn't see that coming. What's that? A meteor? No, no clue. <laughs> this still looks so silly with their mouths. It was the whole reason we gave them the voice we did. So this is Kanasa. Just their like flappy Muppet faces. <laughs> what a dump. Not much longer till the full moon. Although it's kind of cloudy out. While we wait, why not warm ourselves up? Looks like they're thinking the same thing. All right, a welcoming party. We'll split into two groups. <laughs> they are actually a welcoming party. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Why? We, we brought cheese boards. We don't get a lot of visitors around here. If we'd known you were coming, oh wait, we did. <laughs> we saw this coming a mile away. Oh, no, no, we only no, knew no, you were coming though. We don't know no anything else. Back. We have no idea of what we're your intentions are. And hold on, we're getting those now. Oh no. Oh. Why? <laughs> so, I'm with Borgos then. Yeah. Mm. You watch yourself too. Don't overdo it. <laughs> Where should we get started? For now, let's head toward the city and see how things stand. All right. Genocide on three. <laughs> All right, guys. Keep your body counts high. Damn. <laughs> Real stormtrooper mentality. All right, the heaviest population centers will be near city center, so. Oh, I got Riot Javelin. So what do you think? I think I'll I got to add things to my menu. One sec. This is very important for me. Awesome. Super for, final spirit cannon. Probably don't need meteor sledge. Body impact's good because it does stun damage. Well, yeah, you can strategize. 
Let's Oop. hope it's worth a trip. This area should work. All right, blow it up. Come on, we'd better start looking around. Yep. I think I've found where they're living. <laughs> Sounds like they've got plenty of people in the city. Looks like it, yeah. All that's left is to flatten this town, and the job's done. This is the only what? This is their only population. Literally, their only city. I'm getting reading. They have no suburbs either. Around the city, probably their bases. Aiming from no there, agriculture, nothing. If we attack the bases, that ought to lure some of those dimwits from the city. Beating around the bush. Come on, don't be like that. There's some time before the full moon. Let's just take it easy till then. Look, guys, I already told you, I created a technique to make a moon. Yeah, I'm the one who invented that. Exterminate the Canassan enemies. <laughs> okay. In the enemy's base city. I, I guess I guess we can label them the enemy. Man, this is some real propaganda shit we're going through here. I, I mean, this is a rather just bleak g game for us to play here. Like, we're literally the evil yeah, bad we, guys going through murdering. And we we are doing a genocide. Yeah. We we are we are just doing the Nazis. Oh hey. <laughs> I love you, Borgos. Never change. <laughs> What's the what? point of having that come through this? I don't know. That is the funniest noise I think this controller's ever made, though. <laughs> it might be. Hey. <laughs> sure. What they should have done. Dead set on charging into the city. There we go. I won't stop. You. Took a second. I, mean, I probably could just start to charge headlong into the city, but I guess we'll uh take care of their Who who are you people? No point introducing ourselves. Look, man, I don't want to get attached. Oh no. It's an enemy raid! We need No, it's not a raid. This is an extermination. Seems like they've come from the city, too. All according to plan. Well, time to cut loose, for okay. sure. I do like it, so it's like, okay, we're gonna also destroy all of the buildings. Don't want to- Jesus! This is good. They just keep coming. I just killed like 13 of them in one shot. Damn. Oh no, these people are woefully underprepared for this. They could not see this coming. See, that's the thing about a psychic race. Even if they could see it coming, it's like, what do you do against this? When you're so woefully underpowered. Don't worry, we've actually, <laughs> there's just a couple of specific warriors that have been training for an entire year. Yeah, just, <laughs> we call them the K-Warriors. Alright, I'm going with a consecutive energy barrage, because then I can kill multiple in like one go here. Hey. Ow, you dick! That was my stomach! What is that one move that you got where you can just wipe out a bunch of them? And uh, that, that was just the super, but it, it only works when there's like a few of them in front of me. Gotcha. So if I move back some and then do it... Oh my god! Yeah. Oh, no, no, I meant the other one where it literally triggers like a cutscene. Oh, it's um, it's it's one that like it'll pop up when it says I can do it. Gotcha. I can't just do it whenever. But yeah, you did wipe out like at least ten of them with that. Let's back up and find another group. Let's try out our riot javelin. Eh, less useful. Yeah, I like that. Nice. Oh, the funny number's gone. Somebody fly into that! Wow. 
complete whiff. God, is a target rich environment. I should just be able to fire wherever. Imagine if you could do like a uh, one of those AOEs right now. Or if I could angle this as I fire it. But yeah, like a, a final explosion or something like that. Yeah. Just boom. Halfway there. Oh. House. Okay, I got three with that one, but I also like take out a lot of their health with it too. See what happens when I power up for like no reason. Oh my god, pretty effective. I'm out of energy. <laughs> yeah, I know, at some point. Hold on, I need a breather. Beating you guys up will raise my energy. If I just stop and take a breather and only punch you rapidly for a moment, I'll be fine. That's how boxing works, right? The faster you punch, the quicker you recover. Pretty good. That's the most damage they've done to you since you got here. Right? Only I remembered how to block. Oh my god, it does nothing. I mean, they did a good job implementing, like, kind of a Dynasty Warriors mentality into this, but unlike a Musou game, it is hard to hit, like, multiple people with just a combo. But this is probably about as close as you could get to a Dragon Ball Z Dynasty Warriors thing. Dragon Ball Z, yeah. Ah, a conjurer. I'm gonna punch him in the dick and kill him. <laughs> that, that didn't do much, did it? I'm guessing that... Oh, he's ah, level good. 25. He actually uh, takes hits. Ooh. Oh, God, no. He's dead. Oh, that did not... That did not work out. Okay, we killed them all. Sad. Sad truly, for them. Truly sad. Which is sad. Sad for you. Put a fork in this spot. It's done. Glad we have one liners for this genocide. Yeah. Smash and bash? Alright. Smash and bash. Destroying bases. And it's gone. And destroyed. Look at it go. Must have dropped off this mortal coil by now. Just to be on the safe side. Huh? I dropped off this mortal coil? Sent them to the next dimension. This is gonna be a whole lot of fun. I'm sure it is. This genocide is gonna be a real blast. <laughs> Who's ready for a wicked say in summer, am I right? Easy there, Chief. We're just playing around. What she said. Yeah, just playing at genocide. And we'll continue our genocidal efforts next, next time, time on TFS Plays Barbacoa. <laughs>